see. You know? Oh, I doubt it. I, I, I think, like he said, we are very spiritual beings. And not just spiritual, we're also very religious beings. <laughs> and quite traditional as well. It's like a whole mishmash of hocus pocus. Um, so I, I, I actually, it's not far-fetched. I, I, people are always famanyamin and expecting the good they threw out into the world to come back to them. And I, I think it's, it's something people can, can get on if they were to think about it seriously. And it's something we already do, but we probably haven't articulated it the way he said it, right? Many people have this faith and this hope in God to set things straight in their lives later on. When you're in trouble, um, faith is so intangible and it does sound crazy to people, but it's something that we hold on to so strongly. It's, it's powerful. We have, and uh, honestly, it's like the law of attraction thing yeah, that Ida yeah. was just talking about. What you believe and you hope in and you put your mind and your efforts into, it comes, it comes to you, you attract it to you. So like I'm saying, it's just not what, uh, having an ambition is a kind of faith. Right, but we just see it in a certain way. But it's is faith going to school and working so hard and writing all these exams and telling yourself, I'm going to graduate and get this kind of job and live this kind of life. It's faith. 